Claws of Tigers. I'm Chloe from the Olympians. And I'm Anders from the Legends. Today is Monday, February 23rd, and it is a red day. Now let's wave it on over to the pledge. Hi, I'm Emma from the Heroes. And I'm Sophie from the Olympians. Now please join us in the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now let's wave it on over to the newscasters. Sorry to be gone so soon, but we have a video from J. Crew. Texts me so like twice a year. No, once. Don't make me sad. <laughs> okay, what's for lunch today? A spicy chicken sandwich, personal cheese pizza, or premium meals cheese calzone. Yeah, sounds good. Uh, there are no birthdays today, but I do have something to talk to you guys about. So the father daughter dance it didn't go so well. So I'm pulling up on my bike, getting ready to pick her up, and she's in her car with the dad with her dad. It wasn't okay. <laughs> this wasn't okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Remember, J. Crew Group 3 and Yearbook Club meets today after school. Make sure your parent is here at 4 to pick you up. Are you still thinking about that mouth-watering pizza? Who isn't? Well, teams are competing to win a pizza party by collecting box tops for education. There is still time for you to clip your box tops from participating products to turn them into cash for our school. The money helps PTA with paws. Remember, spring pictures are today. And uh, Mr. Duke needs to see these people. Ricky Mastassi, Kendall Rudolph, Akman Brodu, Faith Bakes, Michael Schmidt, and Sam Ream. Now an announcement from Dr. Ivy. Oh, Anders, great job. We might need to give him an Oscar, I think. I don't know if anybody watched the Oscars last night, but I sure did. So I hope you had a great weekend. Um, we do have the spring pictures today. You also should be turning in your enrollment sheets to your home-based teacher. So make sure you have that done. Um, this week was a pretty busy week, and we have acuity testing for uh, English language arts. That'll happen either Tuesday or Wednesday, depending on which team you're on. The element of that's a little bit different for this acuity testing is we're doing this kind of as our map simulation. So we are It'll, map will be a little bit different than it's been in the past. It will be computerized. Um, we are kind of going through that process so that when we do take the map, which is at the end of April, that everyone will kind of know the process. So please make sure you do your very best on this acuity, and we'll do ELA this week, and then we'll do math next week. The other thing I need to tell you, it's the last week of February, and we are required um, by law to make sure that we have an evacuation drill every month. So when I looked at the forecast, it appears as though tomorrow will probably be the warmest day without snow, and the warmest meaning it's like 35. So please dress appropriately and plan on an evacuation drill sometime um, tomorrow afternoon most likely. So please um, help us out with that because it's going to be cold and we have to do the evacuation drill. So um, I wanted to make sure everybody knew about that. And several of you asked me about Marshall the Miracle Dog, the movie that's coming out. And I'm going to be sending information for March 7th, it's a Saturday, of when um, you could attend this, the movie. And we'll be giving away some movie tickets for that. So this week, focus on box tops, clip lots of box tops, get those in and um, work really hard on your acuity testing and enrollment. So have a great Monday. Man, I want to see that movie about Marshall. Yeah, three-legged dog and died three times. That's pretty cool. All right, now let's make today count and join us in our sign-off. It's, it's a great, great day to be a tiger. <laughs> Rawr.
Good afternoon, Plaza Tigers. I'm Chloe from the Olympians. And I'm Anders from the Legends. It is, today is still Monday, February 23rd. And I'm going to it on over to the weather. <laughs> hey, Tigers. I'm Michaela from the Olympians. I'm going to be Plaza Meteorologist today. Meteorologist today, and this is weather with me. Let's look at the current conditions. Right now, it is... 21 degrees outside and it feels like 14. And as you can see, the background is palm trees with the sun shining on it, which we do not have here. Tear. Alrighty, let's look at the Sunday forecast on Monday and Tuesday. Well, on Monday it's 23 degrees with the low of 7. Tuesday it's 45 degrees with the low of 15. And then on Wednesday there's a 40% chance of snow and Thursday there's a 30% chance of snow. And then Friday through the weekend it is in the 20s or 30s with 30% chance of snow on Saturday and 40% chance of snow on Sunday. Today's birthdays are nobody. Woo. Fun facts for today are it's possible to lead a cow upstairs but not downstairs. And dogs have four toes on their feet hind feet and five on their front feet. So now you have something to look at your dog's feet at home. Um, the birthday pencil is with this cute little piggy. And that was weather with me. Well, I'm going to go home and check my dog's paws out. <laughs> me too! <laughs> Remember, J. Crew Group 3 meets tonight, and Yearbook Club also meets tonight. Make sure your parent is here at 4 to pick you up. All right, this week is the last week for the box top competition. This year, the, um, so far, the Olympians are in the lead, but the Knights are close second. Box tops for education are found on hundreds of products that you purchase for your household. You can clip these off box tops, these products, and earn money for <laughs> Plaza's PTA. In the month of February, each Plaza team will collect the box tops. Well, it is the month of February. Just, you just got to turn them in. Let's go, Legends. Olympians, woo! Stay in first. <laughs> legends. Oh, I'm Olympians. Olympians. Okay. All right. Now an announcement from Dr. Ivy. Hey there. Um, we have some exciting news to share. I know the Thunderbirds heard about this because they've really been um, had a lot of information today. But we have some amazing spellers here. All three of these Plaza students um, placed in the top 10 for the Park Hill School District Spelling Bee. That was on Saturday, right? Not Sunday. Yeah. So Cooper, he placed, what was your final placing? Do you Seven. know? Seventh out of everybody who competed. And Elizabeth, what was your place? Fourth. Fourth. And can I get a drum roll, please? All of us, do a big drum roll. Allison placed first. Oh my gosh! She is going to Washington, D.C. for the National Spelling Bee at the end of May. So, high five, girl! Yay! All right, so, um, Allison, tell us your words, the hardest word you had, not the last word, maybe. Obstreperous. Obstreperous. O B S T R E P E R O U S. Hmm. Obstreperous. Come over this way, Elizabeth. Do you think, did you hear that word? Were you still there? Yeah, I yeah. said for it all. How, what did you think on that word? Tough? What was your last word? Peasant. Peasant. Cause I could spell pheasant, but I can't spell peasant. Oh. I don't They're know. Probably at the end, the A and the E? Yeah, I said E and T instead of A and T. That happens. Cooper, what was your word? Um, It was bongra. Bongra? What's B -H -A -N -G -R -A. that? B-H-A-N-G-R-A, that's how you spell it. <laughs> what is that? Um, you know? It's a form of music, I think. Yeah. Oh. How about that? I bet Mrs. Ruan and Miss Chambers knew all about that. Uh, well, we, I'm so proud of all these students. We're going to do photo ops tomorrow, so bring your hardware, okay? okay. And um, when you see these guys in the hall, tell them, great job. Way to um, show off Plaza being super smart. So have a great evening. We'll kick it back to the newscasters. Good job, guys. That's Woo! really good. I can barely spell. <laughs> D O V? I don't know. Are right, you trying to spell dog? I don't know. <laughs> um, good job, Allison, for getting first place. Woo! I'll see you in Washington, D.C. 
No, I'm not going there. I wish I could. That'd be cool. That'd be really cool. I could like president and everything. I'll like sit on Abraham Lincoln's lap. He'd be like, he can tell me a bedtime story. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. I'll see you later. Hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Doctor Ivy. Doctor Ivy. Hold on. Um, bus 66 is S3 tonight. Bus 66 is S3. Oh, we forgot Tra transportation, transportation changes. changes. Uh, transportation changes uh, for tonight are car riders, Alec Riker and Jake Kelly. Uh, you guys are both car riders, and Jillian Bonikowski, you are a bus rider. Bye, Plaza. Goodbye. <laughs>